It's the teeny butterfly. Testing, testing, test, test, test. Hello, every. Oh dear, so so sorry about that. The volume was a little loud there. Hello, everyone. Starting today, I'll be doing island live broadcast full of island updates, going on, and such. Now, it's only fitting if we kick off this daily ritual with a doozy of an island announcement. The Florida by Airport is now open for business. Starting today, you can use online and local communication to fly to other islands for a visit. But the airport counter now offers postal services. And just like the resident services center, the airport is open 24 hours a day. So please do drop by for a look. That's all for me. I do hope you all enjoy another fine day of luxurious Flutterby living. from Nintendo. Dear Cat, congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift as that is sure to come in handy. This one's from Mom. Dear Cat, how is your new life treating you? Are you eating well? Brushing your teeth? Washing behind your ears? Oh dear, I'm all worked up. Here's a little something to help out. Eat it, plant it, but think of me, Mom. Simple DIY workbench. Pears. Oh, there's Rudy. Yo, cat. That spot you found for me is just incredible. Thanks. I hope we can keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies, Mush. Oh, right. I've got something here for you, Mush. Thanks again for finding a place for my place. The tulip hat is perfect for Flutterby. You can try it on pressing X to open your pocket, then press A to select the item you want. Choose where if you want to put it on. You can always change later if you need to work out, Mush. <laughs> oh, and there's Flo. Yo, Cat, I'm getting a real good vibe from that tent plot you picked for me. Thanks for the hand. We've got to look out for each other here. If you ever need anything, don't be shy, cha. Oh, yeah. I was thinking about how to thank you, and I came up with a recipe for a leaf umbrella. All right, so the first thing I thought when I got here was, now that's a lot of weeds. That's kind of where I got the idea. It's a DIY project that uses weeds. If you've never done a DIY project before, you should ask Tom Nook to help you out. 
He's doing free DIY demos over at the resident services. As you can see, it's quite cozy in here. It's funny how cozy doesn't always mean comfortable. Hmm? Let me know if you need advice on how to spend your time on this island or anything else. If you need some advice about basic island materials, you should talk to Timmy. He can help you procure some of the essentials for thriving in our little paradise. And if you want to earn some bells, he has a rather generous policy of purchasing just about anything. Not strictly advisable from a business perspective, but quite generous. Yes, yes. Oh, one more important thing. I'm offering a free DIY workshop that can help you really build out your island experience. I think it would be quite useful, so I do hope you take me up on it. Hmm? Yep. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. About that workshop. Yes, yes, the DIY workshop. Each participant will make and keep their own tools and receive a set of DIY recipes. I think it will be quite useful for island life. Hmm? So shall I put you down for the next available session? I'd love to. Yes, yes, that's the island spirit. I happen to be free right this very moment, so let's get started. Welcome to my DIY workshop. Oh, I suppose workshop is overselling it a bit. Hmm? When you see how simple it is to DIY or do it yourself, you'll understand what I mean. The basic idea is to gather materials, follow a recipe, then craft using the workbench like this one. So today we'll be constructing a fishing rod using common materials that you can find anywhere, yes? For the particular recipe we require, I mere five tree branches. It is admittedly a little flimsy. Now then, come see me once you've collected the materials. Hmm? the necessary materials. Hmm? Well then, let's get started on crafting that fishing rod. Yes, yes. To begin, just select a project from the workbench and get started. Go ahead, give it a try. I 
made a flimsy fishing rod. Yes, that was perfect. As you can see, crafting is quite simple provided you provided you have the correct recipes. Hmm? And that concludes my free DIY workshop. Oh, there's just one last thing. I have a few common DIY recipes for you, free of charge, naturally. I'll just need to send them to your Nook phone. Would you mind opening it up? Splendid! Thank you! The DIY app is now installed on your phone and ready for you to use any time. And the flimsy fishing rod you just crafted is yours to keep. It may not last forever, but it should serve you well for a little while at least. Speaking of fishing, I am no master angler, but perhaps I can give you a few tips. Hmm? In my experience, you should aim in front of the shadow of a fish when you cast your line. Yes, yes. I would love to see anything you manage to catch. I'm quite curious about the local fauna. DIY recipes. Check this app for info on the DIY recipes you've collected. Let's see, and I got the DIY work. Oh, two recipes. Yeah, the workbench. Sweet! I learned a DIY recipe for a simple DIY workbench. I learned a DIY recipe for a leaf umbrella. Whoops. Oh. Let's go over here. Let's try some fishing. Catching this one. Come on. I caught a bitterling. It's mad at me, but only a little. <laughs> a dab. Not bad. Oh, let's 
see the liver this way. Oh, another one. Cut a squid. It's off the hook. So we got Rudy and Flo as our starters. Crucian carp. My skills are sharp. Another bitterling. So let's see, I only need one more fish to turn into Nook. I caught a pond smell. Whatever, whoever smelt it, dealt it. Yeah, what I think I want to do with the DLC is invite each of um, my amiibo to the island and create uh, um, vacation homes for each of my amiibo. Have a look, shall we? Let's go this way. Start with this. Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a bitterling. Hmm, if this island can support a bitterling, why, who knows what other fantastic creatures we might find living here? I have an idea. An old friend of mine runs a museum, and I'd love to send it to him for a closer look. Would you be okay with that? Okay. Thank you. I promise that I'll take extra good care of your bitterling. Oh, that reminds me. This is in no way tied to your generous donation just now, but I have a useful app to show you. I 
I sent you the Critterpedia app. It's a terrific resource for an aspiring island researcher such as yourself. With this one app, you'll get all the important details about the bugs, fish, and sea creatures you catch. I do hope you'll continue to fill it up with your discoveries and share them with me too. I'm sure I'll be able to come up with some kind of additional reward. Hmm? Oh, another creature. Well, let's have a look at this one as well. Oh, what a catch. I do believe this is a dab. Would you mind if I sent this magnificent creature along to my museum curating friend as well? Okay. Thank you. I promise that I'll take extra good care of your dam. Oh, by the way, have you been taking advantage of my DIY workbench lately? Not really. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Do you know? You do know that you're welcome to use it any time. Perhaps you could just use some new DIY ideas. Do you mind turning on your phone? I just sent you a number of DIY recipes that require wood, along with the recipe to craft an axe. Yes, yes, I think an axe would come in quite useful on this island. Because so many other things are made of wood. I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all part of the island experience. Yes, yes. I do believe this is a squid. Okay. By the way, I have a proper reward for you this time. I've given you some red Tyson bags. Just a little sampling of a product we sell. Go ahead and do some planting, and after a few days you'll have beautiful blooming flowers. Anyway, give it a whirl. And if you enjoy gardening, stop by and buy more. Oh, remember the flower samples I gave you? I forgot to mention something. The flowers that grow will be very strong. They'll spring up even if you just plant them and forget them. Ah, but if you water them each day, that's where the magic happens. Watering opens up the possibility of propagating 
and cross-beating your flowers to develop their colors. And how might you water them, you ask? Well, I've just sent you the DIY recipe for a watering can. My accountant warned me about giving this sort of thing away for free. But you've collected creatures for me, cat, so this is just part of island give and take. I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all part of the island experience. Yes, yes. Let's see, I think this is the last one we need. Hold the phone. Someone's calling. Blathers, is that you? Oh, what splendid timing. Yes, yes, do you remember the adventure we discussed? Well, it's come to fruition. I'm currently stationed on an island that we've decided to call Flutterby. Yes, yes, the local fauna are as abundant as expected, just as I told you. Mm -hmm. How many precisely, you ask? Well, there's no way of knowing just yet. But I've received, let's see, five outstanding specimens so far. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? Seriously? Well, that is very exciting. Oh, but you'll have to excuse me. I'm with a customer right now. I'm so sorry to keep you waiting. That was my friend Blathers, the one who curates a museum. Believe it or not, he's going to come to our island to help us identify and preserve the local creatures. Ah, oh, but I could use your help, Kat. Since you've done so much scouting and collecting already, would you be able to help me find a spot for Blathers? We need a good size space to really build out a world class museum, so do keep that in mind. This is exciting. It's all coming together. Yes, yes. Let's see, will it work here? Okay, just does not want to go there. Would this be a good spot for Blathers 10? Let me imagine it.
We'll have to do a little landscaping, but we can make this work. Should we go ahead? Okay. Blathers can set up his place now. everyone that's it for this video if you liked it and would like to see some of my others please like and subscribe thanks for watching and i hope to see you all in the next one